And so, now I am going to be showing you something I have worked on. And in case you didn't know, my name is Ty or Title Force Gaming. So here's something I've been doing for a little bit. The the pointless button, as I like to call it. It's basically a how would I say this? A um kind of gambling simulator. It'll do like a random outcome, and then it'll either light up here for good, or here uh, here for good, or here for bad, as the signs say. So it says hit the button. So that's what I'm gonna do. Something bad happened, and I just lost 5,000 bits. Whoops. Nothing. Something good happened, so now I have zero points. Oh, and by the way, anyone, if anyone cared, that's my friend's account. He's letting me borrow this. So. Th that, that was the rare one. Something good happened, and something bad happened. It happens, because I'll show you a behind the scenes soon. So basically, it takes away and gives you your points. So you get nothing. Again, huh? And see, this bad one's lit up, and this good one's lit up. They're both lit up. One of them should disappear. I don't know. Something good happened, so now this one stops. And now this one's going. So yeah, that's how you tell. And so I'm gonna not risk it anymore. And this is the so this was the pointless button. This is the reset. This is the maze, which I'll be working on. This is the impossible parkour. People will probably be commenting, how'd you do this? And I'm dead. That's the troubles. Yep, I tried to swim in lava. So that's the impossible parkour for you. When you beat this, it'll say, um, congrats, I'm just gonna close this and close this. It says only congrats, and then there's a button here. So let's say I'm continued. I pay for adventure, and I'm just like, what? This is all it gives me? Plus 5,000 points. That's also going to be in the description how I did that. This will get due. Block testing. I'll again get to that. That's the block testing. By the way, this has to be played on 1.8. So we, we were here. Possible parkour, maze center, reset button. I won't be um, showing you guys how to do this. You'll have to figure that out on your, by yourself. Point this button. And the block testing, which we got to. So, you're going to have to figure this out on yourself by, by your own. Basically, this resets both the keels, which will be up there. And the points, which will be over here. So when you press this, it says resetting points, points reset, resetting kills, kills reset, and it resets both. So there you have that, and finally now for the maze center. Yeah, I'm not done with it. So right now all I can do is, um, because I'm not done with it, all I can do is do this. And in case you knew, um, here's a bunch of redstone for the unpointless button. So I'm, while I'm here, I might as well do it. Don't need this, don't need this, don't need this. Um, here's the redstone. So it's basically a repeater going into this, which has a lot of arrows. This is the reset mechanism for it, which I won't be covering today. Maybe later. If I get enough things up, that's gone. Basically, it shoots an arrow from here onto one of these pressure plates, and something good or bad will happen. Moving on, 
here is the thing I'm not done with yet. Look at the little bunnies. Oh. Here's something I've been working on as well. Um, spawn point it sets all everyone's spawn point back in there on the on the crafting tables, which I'll show you in a minute. And this clears the weather every time, so you will not have rain. So let's say um, I actually have to activate the um thing. So um, it'll like when the thing runs out of arrows, it'll say, "I'm very sorry, but the dispenser run out of arrows. Please click here to reload it. It'll change your game mode to creative." Here's how I'm gonna get back in. So, yeah. So I wouldn't press that button because you, you know, every time you die, you lose five thousand points. So should should it be that you get five thousand points for the um for every kill? I think for every. Yeah, I think that's how it's gonna be. Well, in Delta Maps too. Save Delta Maps too. And so, yeah, you come back right here. So say um, you die again. You spawn right here. So you go in here. So your name like this or a whatever. Oh, and you start dying. We're going to respawn here because of that command lock. Just to prove my point. Well, I can just hit that. <laughs> so yeah, that's the point of this button. I've basically covered everything, so now I'm just going to be working on it. Yeah, I forgot about that. See, so, and by the way, I don't know the creator of the skin, but whoever it was, they're awesome. <sighs> so now we'll be working on the maze. I think we're going to have... I actually did make a mobile version, Dangerous Maze Mobile, but that's just a Dangerous Maze. Yeah, you heard me, guys, right? I said dangerous maze. The dangerous maze is a project I had an idea for and I started working on. And basically, you know, I don't like how this looks. I'm moving back a bit. So, um, basically, the dangerous maze is a maze. You can die a lot. You are going to die a lot. <laughs> Unless you guys are like hackers with like x ray. Not saying you are, just saying if you are. Yeah, that made no sense, didn't it? So. Yeah. We're going to make several different mazes. I like computer versions, so yeah. I want to use this at one point. Like, how much FPS am I getting? Oh, it's 30. That's bad. I had like 100 last time. I literally had 100, so we're going to entitle this. What is going on? Let's see if I can quit something. Hmm, what can I quit here? Yeah, I'm gonna quit this. Didn't look like anything important. Just a program taking up mom. And so this will be on forest. be uh what should this be um I'm gonna make it desert
This will be exit. <laughs> By the way guys, the map save will be available. And then here we are with... Exit. And this will be, um... Uh, Nether, I guess. Pretty good redstone, or so not to do a lot of stuff with redstone. So yeah, just be warned. My mazes are dangerous when I say they are. Uh, now I'm getting more FPS, slightly more. I don't know why it was lagging so bad. It's just lagging because I'm recording. Kind of annoying. Stone setter. I have redstone, don't I? I think I need to. Yep. Have enough. Oh, it's also these that are lagging me out. should be always day. So, yep. And so now whenever it turns to a certain time time. Set. Set night, you could say. So whenever it gets too dark, it'll um it'll set it back to day. I think I'll be working on the maze itself because on camera because then it would like give it away. Yeah. So this is probably the end. So thanks for watching and um, see you next time. Goodbye.